GTA 5 has three protagonists, each one with unique abilities and background. Michael DeSanta. He is a retired bank robber who lives in a luxurious mansion in Los Santos with his dysfunctional family. He made a deal with the FIB to fake his death and start a new life, but his past catches up with him when he meets Franklin, a young repo man who becomes his protege. He also reunites with his former partner Trevor, who was still angry at him for betraying him years ago. Michael is skilled at shooting, driving, and using bullet time to slow down time during combat. He has a history of violent outbursts, such as throwing a TV out of his window, smashing a laptop, and destroying a yoga instructor's car. He also suffers from depression and insomnia, and frequently visits a therapist. He is an avid movie fan, and has a collection of classic films in his home cinema. Michael DeSanta is voiced by Ned Luke, who also provided his likeness and motion capture for the character. He is the oldest of the three protagonists, being 48 years old in the game. He is also the richest, having a net worth of over $20 million. He is a fan of classic rock music, and his favorite radio station is Los Santos Rock Radio. He is also skilled at playing tennis and golf, and can improve his skills by playing these sports in the game. Franklin Clinton. He is a street hustler who works for a car dealership that scams customers. He dreams of making it big in the criminal world, but is held back by his friends and family who are stuck in the gang lifestyle. He befriends Michael, who mentors him and introduces him to the high-end heists. He also works with Trevor, who respects his ambition and loyalty. Franklin is skilled at driving, stealth, and using special driving abilities to maneuver vehicles better. Grew up in a poor neighborhood and joined the Chamberlain gangster families at a young age. He was mentored by an older gangster named Lamar Davis, who is still his best friend and partner in crime. He also has a dog named Chop, who can help him in some missions. He is interested in cars and motorcycles, and owns a customized Buffalo S and a bagger. Franklin Clinton is voiced by Sean Fontenot, who is the cousin of Young Melee, the voice actor of Carl Johnson from GTA San Andreas. He is the youngest of the three protagonists, being 25 years old in the game. He is also the poorest, having a net worth of around $100,000. He is a fan of hip-hop and rap music, and his favorite radio station is Radio Los Santos. He is also skilled at driving motorcycles and bicycles, and can improve his skills by riding these vehicles in the game. Trevor Phillips. He is a psychotic drug lord who operates in the rural areas of Blaine County. He is a former military pilot who suffers from mental instability and violent impulses. He is also a loyal friend to those he trusts, such as his partner Ron and his employee Wade. He discovers that Michael, his old friend and partner, is alive and tracks him down in Los Santos. He also teams up with Franklin, who he sees as a potential ally. Trevor is skilled at flying, explosives, and using a rage mode to deal more damage and take less damage. He has a Canadian accent and claims to be from a small town near the border. He has a history of drug abuse, mental illness, and violent behavior, which often gets him into trouble with the law and other criminals. He is also bisexual and has had relationships with both men and women. He is obsessed with Michael and considers him his best friend, despite their rocky past. Trevor Phillips is voiced by Stephen Ogg, who also provided his likeness and motion capture for the character. He is the most unstable and violent of the three protagonists, having a history of drug abuse, mental illness, and criminal behavior. He is 45 years old in the game, and has a net worth of around $500,000. He is a fan of country and punk music, and his favorite radio station is Rebel Radio. He is also skilled at flying planes and helicopters, and can improve his skills by flying these aircrafts in the game. 